In this video, we're going to explore the generative AI capabilities uh, in Salesforce. So the very first thing that uh, we require is uh, Salesforce Einstein One Studio. So it's a, it's a pack of uh, features that will help you to explore uh, or, or leverage uh, generative AI features uh, within Salesforce. So um, as a first step, we need an org to try this Einstein generative AI features, isn't it? So there are three features right now baked into this uh, into this uh, Einstein One Studio. So we have something called the Copilot Builder, which is uh, which is nothing but uh, an intelligence bot, you know, AI intelligence or intelligent bot. And we have Prompt Builder, which helps you to build prompts. So just like how we interact with ChatGPT, Copilot, and other AI tools, isn't it? So this Prompt Builder will help you to configure a prompt that can be reused. So that's why it's called Prompt Builder or Prompt. Uh, prompt builder templates so we can create reusable prompts using this feature called prompt builder yeah and also we can uh, uh, through this prompt builder we can leverage uh, existing models from players like uh, open ai uh, from uh, anthropic from uh, you know from uh, 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 microsoft etc so so uh, i can also build uh, my own model llm model and i can also integrate that with the uh, salesforce prompt builder so it can leverage my own llm yeah so that's also possible using this model builder so right now these three features are baked into Einstein one studio we will explore one after the other and then see how uh, you know it powers up uh, you know sales marketing and the uses of salesforce right uh, in uh, to in enhance their efficiency and productivity yeah so what we are going to learn is uh, we are going to talk about two ways in which we can create uh, Einstein One Studio org and org where Einstein is enabled. Yeah, option one is using trial account. Option two, if you have uh, if you are a partner with Salesforce, you have access to um, you know partner learning camp with a lot of materials to learn about Salesforce products and you can also create demo orgs. Just like how we create a playground orgs using trial head, we can also create demo orgs uh, with uh, pre-configured, uh, uh, with pre-configured, you know, uh, products with pre-configured with uh, uh, with sample data. Yeah, so so that helps a lot. Yeah, if you are a partner, you can go with option two. Otherwise, go with option one. You know, uh, we can do that as well. So let's let's look into option one first. All we have to do is we first have to you know uh, get into trial head org. Yeah, trial it account and then just search for either you know copilot or prom builder yeah i'm going to search for copilot okay so there are product there are there are projects there are modules that salesforce has put together to help us understand to help us learn einstein one studio features yeah so if you search for copilot or you can search for prom builder you will you will you will just you know see the search summary so you can just go with this quick start uh, project and uh, i'll go here so you will see an option to set up einstein a playground i have already you know uh, i have already done with the setup so that's why it says connect playground otherwise you will see an option you will see a button which you can just simply click and it will send you an email to the registered you know to, the, to, your, uh, to your to your inbox with a link to reset the password and then uh, get into your org yeah, so I've already done that. But in your case, if you're doing it for the very, very first time, you will see a button, a simple button that will help you when you just click on it, it will send you an email. So you can just see this, right? It says that it sends a, it has sent a password reset email and this is how it will look like. Okay, so all I have to do is just click the link and then, you know, simply log in, simply reset the password. So the moment you reset the password, yeah, so I've done that already. Let me try to log in and then see how it uh, shows up. Let's see what happens when we log in. All right, it's trying to take me to the org. So right on the home page, okay, right on the home page, you will see few things or just, you know, just an icon. You can just see this right here, right? Einstein. So this indicates that the Einstein AI is or the Einstein generative AI is already enabled in the org. So you don't have to do anything. So it's, it's there for you, you know, uh, it's there for you uh, by default. Okay. Yeah, it's pre-configured. But what if this is not available? What if this is not available? Yeah. So how do I enable that? We can just see that in the, in the subsequent videos. Yeah. But for now, if you see Einstein icon right here, then you're all, all you know, good to go. Okay. 
so that's the first thing yeah uh, option one where which you can uh, tra using trial ed you can create a create an org right all by yourselves to to learn and then try some samples yeah option two if you are a partner right if you are a partner and uh, uh, you can leverage demo org as well so all you need to do is you need partner learning camp uh, get into partner learning camp so this is the url partnerlearningcamp.salesforce.com slash yes and you can just use your salesforce credentials to log in into the org so let's first log in into the org and then see and then see you know how to create a demo org with einstein ai yes this is this is how the partner learning camp homepage will look like and what you have to do is you have to go with go and then use demo org option which helps you to create you know an org uh, uh, a simple demo org uh, with the pre-configured products with uh, with you know a lot of uh, sample data to work on etc let's let's create a demo org and then see how it looks like yeah i'm gonna click on demo org all right this is how it will look like you know all you have to do is you just have to go to demo org and then you know uh, choose sdo simple demo org yeah and you will see where your partner email address your company name everything pre-filled after which you can just simply click on submit so this will you know take at least an hour for salesforce to send you an email with a link to create with a link to reset your uh, password for sdo org so once an email is received and after you reset the password you can log in and then turn on einstein ai or einstein one studio or einstein generative ai you know uh, einstein ai setup yeah so this is this is option two for us yeah so either i can use uh, uh trial it or i can use partner learning camp so in the subsequent videos you will just see how we can able to enable einstein generative ai yeah because the thing is when you when you use trial it yeah, you can just see the see the see the feature Einstein Gen AI automatically enabled. But when you go with Partner Learning Camp, or if you have an existing org and then you are purchasing Salesforce Einstein One Studio license, right, uh, from Salesforce, so you need to turn on Einstein Gen AI feature so that you can use Copilot, Prom Builder, you can generate personalized emails for Salesforce using Gen AI feature, etc. Yeah, so let's see how we can able to, you know, enable the enable uh, Gen AI capabilities in the subsequent videos.